Hi guys, Lee here from Trading College. It is the 18th of February. So just take a look at the FTSE spread bet trades this morning. Um, here's the five minute chart of the FTSE 100. You gotta bear in mind between seven and eight o'clock, the spread is wider. Two points with IG index. Uh, as soon as we get through the 8 a.m time then that reduces to one pip spread alongside the DAX as well so that that window of opportunity in seven and eight you've got that two point spread so we come in the door this morning in the live trading room we see that we, we turn red straight away uh, we've pretty much got red pro trend system red momentum trigger the market drops all this way from around seven uh seventy two thirty five nice move higher we had a trend predictor short as well in there as well and nice move down now the problem with taking this short which was perfectly fine to do because we had some bearish price action but the problem with taking that short is that we are trending higher with green pro trend system on the daily so it's not a good idea to be uh, short in the market when the trend on the daily time frame is green pro train system momentum's rising higher here guys but there was some bearish price action i.e we had some two-way divergences coming off the high which was signaled here so two-way divergence brought the price down to support and that's where you really got to stop short in the markets because we're into um, that support area okay so interesting markets this morning on a monday morning we could have done without that type of trade on a monday morning um but nice profits to the downside that was a decent size move there about 30 odd points 30 spread betting points don't forget if you're trading the markets and you're spread betting then a 30 point move like this multiply that by your pounds per point at 10 pounds a point and you can you can up to your position size in with these intraday trades because you can have a much tighter stop um, you know, you're looking at a 300 pounds gain there, spread betting gain on that move. Now, it was this move that was the exciting move. As we come down here, we've got this trend predictor green arrows telling us get ready for long side trades. And then we had the momentum rising on the storyteller. So it was this trade in here which took it up 72.18 um, to 72.24 zone and scalped it to the long side for a move. So if you're looking for your day's money, there was there was two opportunities for you. This one to the downside, this one with the trend predictor long up into this zone, anything from um, seven or eight points uh, to trade there, okay? So you could be up about 380 today, roughly around that position. Uh, we were all looking at shorting that, and then that little scalp to the upside in that market okay so interesting place it's never a good place to be when you are um looking for shorts when the market is trending higher what do you want to be doing you want to be looking for long side trades you know we want to be looking for long trades when the daily time frame is also long if that happens just like uh go back to last week's trading just like um here okay so this long side trade signal nice momentum trigger we push up we've got lots of yellows for re-entries nice momentum trigger and the daily is up and then your five minutes up you're looking to trade it in that direction all right guys hope it helps and we'll go again tomorrow morning speak to you soon